Hello everyone, my name is Rumat and today we're going to do a Talia Meat Guide. This is going to be the last video in that series which I barely even made videos for unranked masters because I've reached two days ago master on Europe Nordic and East and I am going to probably fall soon until my matchmaking rating adjusts but still currently I'm in master at 0 LP. I, am, I will probably gain at around 50 LP and lose 20 as I did in Diamond 1 and Diamond 2 until the matchmaking adjusts. So yeah. Anyway, I'm here to bring you a game on mid lane against Vladimir and I'm having... The enemy is having Nasus jungle for some reason. And yeah, this is a high elo game, so I'm not sure if this works or not, but there are some OTPs who's going to play that and I can't really do much about it. I'm playing with Ignite, by the way. Electrocute, Cheap Shot, Eyeball Collection, Ravenous Hunter, Cup the Grace, Presence of Mind and these rune stats. I'm going to play with GLP probably, into Sork Shoes, into Morello, because they have three champions that heal a lot, even this guy with Grasp. I'm going for, okay he has ring, I'm going for Rabadons after that or a stopwatch because I'm against champions that want to murder me like Vladimir with the flash or even Vayne with her dashes or so. Also I might go for a magic resist item or a second door on early on because at level 6 Vladimir with a full bar can flash ignite. Uh, EQ, W, full combo me, and I don't like that. And this guy deals so much damage with auto attacks. What is that? I mean, I know the little Q doesn't deal that much, but I have magic resist, right? Yeah, I do. Okay. Ah, it's the it's the Dorans. I'm not used to the Doran ring of Vladimir, cause <laughs> generally don't you don't buy mana items on that, but I suppose it works for that extra poke. And also, I'll have to be careful around the Nasus. I'm gonna do a Deep word here because no minions will die from me in this context. I'm gonna put it right here. I'm pinging that it misses, so either here or here. I'm gonna lose that one minion, it's fine. I'm gonna obviously we're going to lose bot because our support it's a Morgana OTP, it's a Lissandra OTP. Also, I'm gonna get pushed away here. I lost the cannon because he had the pressure there, I could have gone for it, didn't care much. Gonna miss that, gonna proc electrocute, it's cool. Unless I have GLP, I'm not expecting to hit much W's. I found out that this, this cello is pretty much impossible against good players, especially the ones that have boots, to do that. And I really hate supports that talk after they aren't on their main role, but we're going to see how we're gonna do that. Now he's having 3 CS advantage, a cannon minion and uh, I'm getting pushed away when he has opportunity to do so. I'm uh, behind in experience because I went to put that deep word to gain knowledge on Nasus. Probably Nasus is going to AFK whole game and we got that on top. It's expected the right for Darius to win. It's expected. Just to auto attack him. Yeah, that's great. He has no potions now. I'm coming. We're, we're actually beating them. We're, we're destroying them right here. The only problem is that I'm missing minion. That minion. This minion. Oh my god, stop. We could have we could have gone for that, but their bot lane would have come, so I don't really care much. Okay, look, here is Nasus. If I hit that, could have killed him, but... <laughs> <laughs> Are they doing or what? What was that? He went for the stack on that. <laughs> the only good thing is that I'm, if I'm against an Asus, I'm not going to be susceptible to getting killed early on the lane. And so I have time to breathe. Although I am farming like a silver, I'll be honest. Lost so much already. I'm gonna miss that if I'm not getting deep, right? So this game, this game we're going to play around... Uh, around top, we're going to try to set him up as much as we can. We're going. To, we're not going to kill Vladimir if he uses his W properly. We're not. We're simply not going to do that. And I missed that because I. Oh, I hate it. Okay, let's just focus on the farm currently. And what I hate more is that Nasus is going to outscale us heavily at some point. At some point, I like to point out that. And my bot lane is going is going pretty aggressive and I expect them to engage on us right now and because of that I'm going here 
because of that I'm going here I'm trying to see when's the next fight but really didn't it might might be now grace wants to do that as well but I don't I don't really want to I just want to get level six as well and Vladimir if he, come, he comes towards me right now it means that he wants to full engage back off back off back off I can't really save him okay I'm seeing I'm seeing this guy okay maybe if I jump on vein here if I do a dive I'm gonna do a dive I don't care okay okay that worked that worked that worked that worked had no mana for Q but that worked now if Nasus doesn't come here no flash from Nasus let's go let's go boys that went well presumably that was kind of trollish but <laughs> it went well I am 20 CS behind Vladimir has not played but he has a level ahead of me and Jin got the kill Grace got the kill we're good the only good thing about this is the difference on farm on top and the fact that we win early game very hard now with Graves doing this. I'm I believe at this point uh Darius can even two versus one them because 20 CS Shand, 25 CS Nautilus. That went well by the way. One second away from disaster. I want this cannon. I didn't miss it. I'm not gonna miss any more cannons this game, I promise. I'm moving towards the top now, even though I'm behind the level, I don't care. I don't care, I'm moving towards the top. I'm seeing this. I'm gonna put a vision word here. I'm gonna move towards this zone. Okay, kill him, kill him. I think he, he got him. <laughs> You're about to get dived. You're about to get dived. But let's get him, let's get him. What is he doing? This, I don't know, he's tilted. That was not a master tier play, that was a silver play, as I am playing sometimes. And bot lane, as you can see, because Morgana is filled, she's 0-3. She's playing like she's filled and I expect that, but I really hope she stops feeding. I don't know, Nasus went AFK or what? What is what is this game? I want to showcase quality games, but at this point it just feels that it's a stomp on top, a random moment on mid, and I don't even know what it is on bot. I lost CS on mid, but I did not die, so I guess it's fine. I don't have flash, so I just sneak this out and I'm out. Ah, God. Please don't gang me, please don't gang me, please don't gang me. Okay. It's fine. It's fine, we're fine. Now, if Vayne gets fed and she's fed, uh, you have a vision where they're back off. Guys, take that, please. And Vladimir used everything on the Grace for some reason, because I'm not there to get killed. And Vladimir will outscale me. I'm certain about that, and everyone is, ever, like, so we're not going to be able to fight him. But what I am able, able to is to get GLP, is to play around bot whenever possible. And right now, right now he's level 6 it seems, less CS than Graves. I'm gonna cast an E here. I'm gonna try to... Uh, okay, he pushes me away. Guys. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. We can, we can actually counter this. Did she just alt there? is this why they are playing like this i mean i played like three games in a row against grandmasters and challengers and i expect them to play very well but i think this game is full of diamond ones and me 
or maybe one for the master or so because matchmaking system is very volatile vol vol that word that word when you're at a certain elo you can be matched either with some with full team under your elo or with someone above your elo but generally it doesn't follow a rule so you kind of get matched into the game they find if your matchmaking rating is low then obviously you're going to get matchmaked against lower elo people right now i think it's around high diamond one honestly because i lost uh, i think one game or two yeah three games i think at level at that master at zero points and that dragged my matchmaking rating down and yeah but this game goes very well in our favor with the 50 cs difference on top and i'm gonna go towards this scuttle i'd want to do a full combo i'd want to do a full combo on vladimir but what I know is that he will W instantly. The moment I try anything, he will W. But if Graves comes, if Graves comes right here, and he doesn't, if he would have come, <laughs> maybe I could have done something. I have 40 CS behind, I have 4 kill participation, Vladimir has none. It's a good trade, I suppose. I'm gonna do a vision word in the pit. I'm gonna trade that vision word for this one. I'm gonna keep poking the Vladimir. I'm gonna keep poking that because because we want him to. Okay, this works. We want him to be at least low HP somewhere there towards the fight. Can you not instantly die, please? Yeah, Morgana is in thing. Okay, uh, for some reason. Morgana is hard inting right now, I don't know why. And right now I am bot. Could have done no 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 no. Alright, I'm having the time of my life here. 20 FPS and we're actually we're actually winning this. Shenault, obviously. But as you can see, our support isn't really doing anything. Okay, she got she got the Shen. <laughs> I think, <laughs> yeah, she did. But she could have saved. She could have saved Jin. She's she's definitely trolling at this point. Uh, but still, still we got we got a good fight. Grace got the kill. I did not. I got. Did I? Not remembering if I got the kill or not, but Vayne is fed. The only problem is that Vayne is fed, and they play, they play a defend the Vayne comp. But Graves got the kill. Graves got the kill, and his 30 CS ahead is good. I'm only having, I'm only doing, uh, I'm only doing uh, right now a defensive play style towards the top lane and the uh, late. I'm gonna explain rather. In a second, but I want to get this without dying. Come on, come on, get this. Okay, I see Nasus. I don't mind him being there. Darius is not there. We have to take our time. We can't really fight that. We can't really fight that because Morgana is very behind, and so we're not going to be able to do much. I'm gonna ult here. Alright, Vladimir decided nah. Darius, kill Vayne, or win it solo. Alright, and now, for some reason, they are. What are they doing? Right. <sighs> Only Vayne is fed. And if Vladimir stays at this score, it's cool. Darius will d carry it regardless at some point. I just need to keep participating in kills. In as many kills as I can. And we're going to be just fine. Uh, I'm not 
gonna participate in. I should disable chat, Jesus. I'm disliking it heavily. Alright. Can we kill him before I die? Excellent. 26 HP. That went well. This guy is winning. Yeah, we won. We won. Never mind. As I said, Darius is doing a 2 versus 1 on them because. It doesn't work, Nasus and Shen doesn't work. And while I do have bad CSing and that, I do have high kill participation and I am and I'm clearing vision as well around the map. I almost said that same thing twice there. I'm going bot now, I'm sticking to the side lane, I'm picking them to back off whenever necessary. No one in this game can kill Darius alone, not even Vayne, I am certain of that. And that's going to win us. Shen did some good things with those ults, but it doesn't matter. And obviously Shen plays the lane as he should against the Darius, because let's think about it. Can you really beat the Darius with Flash Ghost? I'm missing cannons, I hate it. And I'm going to Deep Ward here. Darius, if Darius dies there, then it's a problem. I'm gonna just put... I'm not going to be able to one-shot that, but I can stick to this lane. There was a ward there. It's fine. I just need to go back to the mid lane whenever possible. I'm just wording some spots to give myself room. I'm not be going to be able to one shot this guy, but at least I can keep perma pushing. I'm getting my farm from this side. I'm getting scuttle. I'm trying to stick to the side, by the way, because it's quite safe for me to do so. Even if trash gangs. It needs you they need more than that. They need more than just two people. They need or either Vladimir or Vayne to put them on me, and even then I can maybe kill Vayne if I'm lucky with a W. Or if they they send two people, it's stupid. No, if I mean if they send one person that tries to outplay me. Vladimir could keep me here forever. Uh Vayne could outplay me. But both of these factors considered are considered on the playstyle. So I'm going here. Trying to get into that bush. Come on, move away. Okay, he's trolling. I'm considering that he's trolling. I even missed the W there. I'm seeing Nasus. I'm going there. Trying, trying to cast a wall. But yeah, no, it's fine, it's fine. Let's get let's get in here now. Both I feel both Nasus and Shen are trolling and Morgana. Uh Graves. Yep. She's gonna flash, no, it's okay. It's cool. We got this. Right. And Darius didn't even come to the fight, so <laughs> that's funny. We got a triple. Obviously, I'm going for the quad. Instant flash, it's cool. Yep, we got the game, guys. Doesn't feel like a master tier game. Probably gonna get 15 for it or lower. But I suppose it is what it is. I'm just having too high expectations when I'm matched against diamonds. That's tr the truth. I'm gonna stay here. I'm gonna do a full combo on Trash, I think. Alright, look how simple it is when you're fed. Look how simple it is. And people sometimes say, why do you play to Liamid? Well, in some contexts it works. In this context, it's mainly about countering the Shen, honestly. And yeah, they do have a sort of a trollish, I don't want the blue, thank you, sort of a trollish uh, comp. But I suppose even if you put a normal jungler, maybe Darius, I mean, surely Darius would still would have won top. And I would have still roam bot, but and bottom would have still trolled, I guess, in terms of Morgana, because she was the one in thing. There are a lot of factors, but in this game... I didn't want to dodge because I've seen their comp, so I guess I thought, well, that could be an easy win. And it turns out it kinda is. I'm not gonna show myself there. Ok, 
Okay, apparently he's not fully trolling. He used a spell. And yeah, generally, if you play Talia into an annoying matchup, let's say, you can just freely dodge, by the way, guys. You can just freely dodge, and then that's going to help you not lose a shit ton of LP. Here, I'm not really afraid of Vayne if I have GLP. I don't have GLP now. So that's why I'm backing off. I also have 3000 gold. And I'm seeing them. Right. That's that's not the ult that I want. Because Trash was instantly hooking that. I kinda trolled with that ult, it's fine. I need to back off anyway. I need to back off anyway, so. Hit the Q Morgana and that target is dead. Not gonna try more than this. Well. Okay. It wasn't particularly dead. <laughs> okay. Look at him go. <laughs> How can you lose with that? <laughs> How can you lose with that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Darius did a pretty nice carry right here. I am I'm 919, right? But that doesn't mean I carry it. The one that carries is on top lane right now, and also the fact that Shen played quite badly. I lagged into an important fight, so I suppose I suppose we have what we have, but the game went pretty well from my point of view. So I guess this is the game. The only major mistake that I do, and I keep doing it even in this elo, it's farming and hitting those cannon in early game. I just need to go into the practice tool and repeat this over and over and I solve that problem. You should also do that as well, especially if you find yourself losing a lot of CS, especially in important moments, in stressful moments when you're on a lane and you're against someone that's an assassin that has a CC that shouldn't hit you and stuff like that. So you should focus on those important facts. You should also focus on uh, getting those W combo right and play, play about them. Play like Try to get the, the macro down, guys, because that's the one of the most important parts in League of Legends to climb. It's not the champion in general. It's, everyone is going to tell you that it's not the champion as much as it's on the macro the, and understandment at a certain point. Obviously, until gold or so, you're going to be carrying games just by playing whatever because you're better at micro. But at a certain point there, it changes and you need to know more macro than micro, a lot more. And if you know that and you know when the enemy is going to cast that CC spell from the bash and surprise you, well, you can just back off and keep going and you can repeat that on him. And he might not be able to know when you're in that bash and you know when he's in that bash. It's an example, but it works. Focus on the macro as much as you can and you're going to climb to greater heights in no time, I suppose. See you next time, guys, and I really hope you enjoyed this game. This was the end of my Unranked Master Challenge. I didn't even do that many videos. I think I'm going to try to stick into the Master now and get to Grandmasters, and then maybe, who knows, I'll try to reach above. I'm hopeful, but I'm not promising anything yet right now. So, yeah, this is the game, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time. Goodbye.